Chum 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 of the month. I have enormous pleasure in uh, introducing as this month's chum of the month my very dear and beloved chum, Mr. Michael Nyman, composer extraordinaire, pianist. Also extraordinary. Oh, and there's a little the nice in Hungarian. We opened the concert hall. We opened the concert hall. As they've said, the concert hall is open for our final concert in this. Yeah. Did you know that? Because he just said it in English. I thought he said it. You never listen. <laughs> Michael, show a bit of joy at being my chum of the month. Chum of the month? It's so, <laughs> I'm so overwhelmed. I didn't um, know such a thing exists. No, I know, I know. Well, now you do. Okay. Um, so we're here doing um, your latest commission, which is this fabulous war work um, to commemorate the 100 years of the First World War. Um, tell everybody about about this, basically, and why me and, um, you know... Uh, why you, Hillary? Because uh, you're the best. Yeah, baby. Uh -huh. <laughs> Um, okay, so I've commissioned by five um, venues in Europe to make a film and to write a soundtrack or to write a piece of music and with a visual track, depends how you look, look at it and listen to it, to, as Hilary said, to commemorate the start of the First World War. And um, the film kind of um, makes sense on its own. Mm -hmm. I went to various um, German, American and French archives, so there's a lot of uh, First World War film, documentary, newsreel footage. There are material from books, there are quotations from poets, uh, there are close-ups of details from uh, avant-garde paintings from from that period. So so the film works according to its own logic, which is interesting in itself. But it has a soundtrack which also works with its own logic. And when you bring the two together, um, I think that's true. Actually, I think it absolutely yeah. does work with sure. its own. In uh, uh, interesting um, <clears throat> parallels are made, conjunctions are made. The, reinforcements are made, sometimes the, the soundtrack is fairly neutral and instrumental and the soundtrack um, looks, looks as though, because that's what it is, is in two parallel halves. There are three or four instrumental numbers, then four songs, then three, four or five instrumental numbers and four songs with the first song reprised at the end and um, I think the songs are the best songs I've written. I think they're tremendous. Um, I remember when you first got the text and you were terribly excited yeah, about it. Because um, what it isn't, it isn't, um, I've got a book of, um, I meant to bring that book with me, a book of uh, mm. a vast compendium of First World War poetry, all written by poets who died during the war. And the temptation, obviously, is to take the war requiem route and set Wilfred Owen a more familiar poetry. But what I decided to do was, since the war was a global event, is to take poems by English poets, two of whom were both poets and painters, David Bomberg and Isaac Rosenberg. German poets, uh, French poet Apollinaire, who in fact was um, Polish, and Ooh. interestingly, one uh, overwhelmingly powerful uh, Hungarian poet, a uh, Hungarian poem. The poems are set in the original language apart from Hungarian, which I, Hillary and I couldn't really make sense no. of. <laughs> and uh, the, the first poet, poet that I found was somebody called Albus Stram, who I'd never heard of, no. and who was connected with, um, with kind of Dada poets and artists. And there's a whole kind of Dada background as well to 
to the film are Dada Connections because they're a bunch of grown men who were in Zurich in 1916, not fighting the war, but um, creating Dada in Cabaret Voltaire. So that's another underlying part of the, the part of the film. And Stram's poems, especially the first poem that I said, which is called Urtard, is basically, it's about 15 lines of poetry, and each line of poetry consists of one word. Uh, it's very unusual and very strong, and, and I think the way you've set it is... And, and it has to be declaimed very yeah. strongly. And when I think of declaiming strongly, uh, I always think of it. <laughs> Although, oh, it's such a although, drama. although I've never actually, I've never said a text like that before, no. and I've never used the voice. But you do like lists, don't you? I mean, that's yeah, a recurring yeah, thing. This, so I suppose yeah. in that point of view, well, it is a sort of. But there could be a pun there because I could have used some, oh, mus some music by, by, Fra list. by Franz oh. List. But instead of which, <laughs> in or and to parallel the um, the international. Uh, set of po poets, I've also chosen some international music. So there are two pieces of uh, English keyboard music from the early 17th century by John Bull and Orlando Gibbons. Uh, there's Rossini, Woodtard, Cesar Frank, violin, first violin sonata, first movement, uh, slow movement from Beethoven's um, Violin concerto. So, so these um, this music that is kind of very, very beautiful mm. and very strong and very powerful and very familiar is kind of reconfigured and relocated, not by messing around with it too much, but just by doing very particular and peculiar I like relocated I or, think it's a very good word orchestrations for the Michael Island yeah. band. And I think the Did you say about the Chopin? Did well the Chopin, yes. Yeah, that is Chopin, best in my, yeah. my So the Chopin view. so the, the um, I think probably a sequence of piano music that no one really remembers. Uh, because it's the C sharp minor middle section of the so-called raindrop prelude, which no one notices because it, you basically go through with this kind of repeating quaver material mm. waiting for the tune to come back. To me is much more yeah, I interesting and that. much more... It's magic, but the only bit of Chopin I could ever play. Much so. more Nyman-esque than... than yeah, uh, very Nyman-esque actually. So that's become the basis for the... Um, the Hungarian. For the Hungarian poem. and. I've not really disguised the fact, I've, I've kind of really emphasized the fact that this music is, is very powerful and very beautiful and it enables me and Hilary to create something that's actually very angry. Yes, it is, yeah. So, there's a, so some, of the, some of the songs are quite playful. And well, they're just with songs, a kick though, aren't they? Yeah, and None other, other just... songs, uh, including two that are set to the two different themes in the slow movement of uh, Shiva. Festival Színházban nyitottuk a nézőteret, Festival Színházban nyitása. Thank you. Um, and um, I think it's one of the angriest pieces of music that I've ever written. But, but also, also very beautiful. Yeah, I mean, it's um, not, you just don't come away. I mean, the response in Paris was, was tremendous, and you had literally people sobbing. Um, as a, I think that was a combination of the film and the music, but it's very powerful, and it's very, um, it's very beautiful and touching mm. as well. As and it's very satisfying to play. And um, <laughs> the charm. <laughs> Um, You've been an old champ for many, I many would, years. I uh, would love to uh, carry on talking for another ten minutes. Yes. But well, next, we have to go on stage. Next, we do yeah. have to go on stage, and uh, maybe I'll grab you for another chair, and we, okay. can, we can explore the lighter side of some Okay, of and the other thing is that we spent the last three days recording and mixing uh, the, the music, the piece, the yeah. soundtrack. Um, 
and it's and very exciting. I everyone think. found it again the best, the best yeah, recording just experience. Fabulous. We've I had can't had wait for it to come out. Time. Yeah, I spent ten and a half hours mixing it yesterday, and it's. Um, I don't. Your schedule is vile. I don't know why you do uh, these things. I think because it has to be done. Well, if I didn't do it that. yesterday, it won't be done for three months. Well, if it's not done for three months. That it won't get released in. Yes, well, then I speed it up, speed, speed, yes, speed. Yes, very yes, good. Yes. Michael, thank you Pleasure. very, very much. Pleasure. Mm -hmm. And maybe I'll see you <laughs> on stage? Yeah, in five minutes. Right.